lack of transparency in the management of political party registries has been identified as a big challenge to the party nominations. This results into poor dispute solving mechanisms in political parties, especially during nominations. Political parties have been urged to embrace dialogue and negotiations to ensure individuals are not locked out of the nomination exercise and that the membership list is submitted on time. This story and other stories to follow. The Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission is attributing lack of transparency in political party registry and knowledge gap as a hindrance in solving disputes that arise in political parties, especially during nominations. According to the Registrar of Political Parties and Deritu, parties should observe discipline and inform its members on policies to be observed before conducting party primaries. IEBC has set 9th of April 2022 as the deadline for political parties membership submission. Ensure that they have credible political parties registers uh, in terms of membership lists, membership register of political parties because they are supposed to use their membership registers. Also, a section of the Mauma War veterans and elders from different communities have called for political tolerance during the electioneering period. Speaking in Nyandarwa, the leaders led by Kihiko Kibue said politicians should desist from divisive utterances for the common good. <laughs> Communities living in Ikipia, Isiolo and Samuru counties have been urged to shun self-centered politicians who use divisive politics and violence to advance their agenda. Ikipia Deputy Governor John Mwaniki called for peaceful campaigns, saying the region cannot afford to sink deeper into conflict. Bado tunapangilia kwenda county ya Isiolo na county ya Samburu kuendesha ama kuhubiri maneno ya amani. Six counties in arid and semi-arid lands are set to benefit from 1.2 billion shillings water project to address the current water shortage in the region. Under the project that will run for five years, some 2,500 households will benefit. Lamu Governor Fahim Tuaha says the program would address the current challenges facing the region thanks to the Danish government. So the need for water will increase manifold. And we need to prepare for it instead of waiting until a crisis emerges. And a family in Yamira is seeking answers over death of two of its members in separate road accidents but almost at the same spot. The family believes their deaths are suspicious and could have been as a result of foul play. Uh, we suspect there was the people behind it because after the accident our, char our brother Jared, uh, it took a long time to be taken to hospital. Irene Mchuma Odim, The Legends Edition.